Hello and thank you for joining our Dash Trader Tips video. Today we'll be showing you how to customize your toolbars. The toolbar gives you quick access to different windows with just one touch of the icon instead of going through the tabs at the top. The toolbar is divided into two sections. The top row gives you options dealing with trades. The bottom row shows you your tools options. Customizing your toolbar. To customize your toolbar, do a right click on the row you wish to configure and select customize. Here you'll see a list of your icons presently on your toolbar. You may change the order of the icons by highlighting it and hitting move up or down. You may also remove or add them to the list by clicking on these buttons here. The drop down menu at the bottom will give you the option to add labels to your icons. It does take up a little more room, but it makes it easier to identify your icons. You may also go through the same procedures to customize your tools options. Creating your own icons. You may also create your own icon for your toolbar. To do this, do a right click on the row you wish to add your new icon to and select new. Then, click on the change icon to select the image that you want. You may choose from the list of images provided here or load a file of your own. For our example, I'm going to create an icon that's going to execute a hotkey function to liquidate all our positions. For our image, I'm going to select a lightning bolt. The label for my icon will be called Panic. On the tooltip, I will give the description liquidates all positions. The command is a script that you will need to input for your action. To help explain, let's take a step back and I'll show you an easy way to obtain the script for the command. By bringing up your hotkey configuration window, you'll see many command script examples. Scrolling down, I see the command script to close all positions. I'll highlight it and do a Ctrl-C on my keyboard to copy the command. Now that I have the script copied, I can go back to my configuration window. I can do a Ctrl-V on the command line to paste the script. Once that's done, I'll click on OK. Now you can see my new panic button on the top here. A mouse over will reveal the description liquidates all positions. Just to show you that it works, I have a position in Intel that I will liquidate by pressing on the panic button now. Looking at my positions window, you can see that my shares in Intel are now gone as a result of the panic button. Thank you for joining our Dash Trader Tips video. We hope this tip will help to enrich your trading experience with your Dash Trader. Once again, thank you for joining us.